Hi. So, I'm making this video because I'm tired of seeing other YouTubers neglecting this aspect of their videos. You've probably heard of what a subtitle is. They're also called captions. Subtitles are pieces of text that say what is being spoken or being heard in a video so that people who are deaf can uh, understand the video. They're also helpful anytime that somebody is difficult to understand, like they have an accent or their microphone is just bad. But a lot of YouTubers don't really put much of any effort into subtitles. Most of them don't even seem like they even think about it. However, even if you don't think about it, YouTube will usually automatically generate subtitles for your video without even asking you about it. You can see these if you go here to subtitles and it says automatic here. That means YouTube automatically made it itself. Automatic subtitles are not always very good though and uh, to demonstrate that let's just go and look at them. Here's a video of mine. Okay, you can probably understand why this isn't um, ideal. First of all, there's uh, almost no punctuation or any sort. And there's no, like, grouping of words into sentences in any way. And having the words come one at a time like this, uh, it's, it's just not very intuitive. It forces you to spend more time looking at the subtitles itself rather than looking at the video. But you can very easily fix this. And to prove to you that this is, is, that this is actually a problem, here's a poll I once did asking what people uh, prefer for when they're using subtitles. 97% of people said they want the videos to be one or two sentences at a time. And if, in case you don't think this is important, here you go. In the last uh, year, 30% of my viewers used subtitles. And for at least some amount of this 30%, they literally needed the subtitles to uh, enjoy the video. If I didn't have subtitles, then some amount of these people just wouldn't have watched the video. So let's, let's not act as if um, this isn't important, because it is. Even if you uh, just, just don't care about accessibility for some reason, you, you, you benefit either way. So, let's see what we can do to fix these. Here we are, subtitles. Mm-hmm. And here we go. This is all the subtitles of this video. So you'll notice, um, now that we've simply gone and said that we're editing this, it's already grouped them into sentences. That's, that's, that, is, that is already a major improvement, but we can do a lot better still. Now, you might be thinking, that you could just get away with uh, uploading your video's original script into this. And um, I see people do that sometimes. Most of the people who do captions at all, that is what they do. And um, that is really obvious when you do that, and it's not good. Sometimes you'll word a sentence differently on the fly or add in a new sentence, stuff like that, and uh, people notice that. I notice that. Don't do that. It's bad. Anyway, all we really have to do here is fix some errors and then add some punctuation. And then we'll go, have to go in and fix the timings. So let's start that now. Make that a capital. Uh, that should not be a capital. Good. That, bam. Bam. Entire sentence done. One of these wooden fence things is Uh-huh. Wow. Wow, this is so difficult. Uh-huh. That's a proper noun. 
wow, this is incredibly difficult. Like, I don't, I don't know how the hell I'm going to do this. This is so hard. Area, comma. You can hear the HEV suits. Warning message edit. Okay, so I'm just going to go and do this for the rest of the video. Okay, and now we'll go and edit the timings. Also, very easy. Uh, I prefer to do this by watching the video at the same time and just looking for any errors in spelling or the timing. It's pretty easy to spot. Things eaten by barnacles are shoved into the space above them. Okay, I don't need to watch any more of that part. One of these wooden fence thingies is embedded deep within this rock wall. like to extend these out just a bit more, then uh, YouTube puts them out. And this is why you need to be careful about uh, timings. Sometimes YouTube will just uh, get them wrong like that. This one piece of grating allows some projectiles to pass through it. And again, make sure they and at the right time as well. If you don't do this, people notice. In the last episode, I said that there was only one fail message in episode one. I was wrong. A bit more. Good. On this map, there is some geometry that was clearly deleted on accident. This is very difficult and very time consuming, as you can tell, clearly. Obviously, wait. Oop. I accidentally almost skipped one. That would have been awkward. If you exit and re enter a certain boundary within this area, you can hear the HEV. Uh, you can hear the. Just a bit. Uh, you can hear the HEV suit's warning message as many times as you want. Uh, so here, there is an in-game caption for the sound, so I don't bother putting in a caption for that. These shards of glass are visible before the glass actually breaks. I, I feel like it's not obvious how wrong this looks, so let's just let's just go and look at this. Don't have, don't have the subtitles starting way before the sentence starts. That just looks bad. This is what your subtitles look like when you don't put in the proper effort. Once I got it to land just so that instead of walking over or around it, Alex teleported around it. Uh, I'm going to put that in this one, because... Good excuse to uh, show off the features here. Alex can be vaporized by this ball holder thingy if she is pushed into it. Again, this just shows um, why you can't just leave the automatic captions how they are. The sense is not even close to starting yet. It's just not okay. Sniper on the right is only used when you're in the next building. Uh, this is kind of awkward here. Like, yeah, 
having it like that just makes a lot more intuitive sense. Sniper on the right is only used when you're in the next building. Having them both on at once makes the room a lot easier. Okay. And that's it. That's it. An entire video. Just like that. Now, I understand this is a, uh, a rather relatively short video, and um, the dialogue is kind of sparse, but I do the exact same thing for all of my videos. And, like, I really don't know what to tell you. Just put the fucking effort in. It's really not hard. Okay, now we've saved that. And let's go look at these uh, captions again. You can clearly see how this is uh, way better. And let me remind you again, 30% of my viewers, roughly like 30 to 25%, use these subtitles. Some amount of these 30%, uh, if I didn't do this, I am very sure that they would uh, click off the video because not having good subtitles is just one way that your video can essentially just suck for some people some amount of people will be turned off because the captions are bad. And in case you go and check this stat yourself, and you see a number that's way lower than this, that would not surprise me at all. Because if you don't do subtitles and you just let your videos have the automatic ones, then some amount, amount of people who rely on subtitles are just not going to watch your videos, or they're, they're just not going to bother using the subtitles at all. So just do them. I don't know how else to say that. Just do it.